Hey everyone, what's up? It's the Emperor Pro here. And welcome back to another episode of the Game Editor series on how to make a side scroller. Uh, in this episode, I will be covering the tiles and like kind of level design stuff. <laughs> so yeah, let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and do that here. We are first thing we're going to do is we are going to create another actor. We're gonna call it tiles, and the tiles will add in we'll add the animation. And let's find tiles one. It's uh, found in the game editor's tutorials data folder. We'll go ahead and click OK there. You click now. You're, now we're going to click the little thing that says tile. We're going to go to single tile, and then we are going to go to no for random tiles. Select the animation, which is tiles one, and draw tiles. Now you'll see you can draw it here. Um, if you press shift, you can you can uh, kind of make it stick to other things like you see here. But we're actually going to start drawing it on the outside here. Hold right control and then click to scroll the screen, and uh, we are going to start drawing here. Make sure you don't. Make sure you have shift selected, otherwise it's going to look like that. You're going to have a whole lot of tiles, and it's just not going to be cool. To erase, hold right shift and then click. Left shift toggles the uh, the lock thing. So I'm just going to make it about one screen width. In the last episode, I believe I covered, uh, or at least the first episode, I covered the screens, which are these little these uh, larger squares here. So this is one screen in width. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, kind of draw a little bit here. I'm just going to change tiles, see how everything would look. Some grass there. Uh, looks like we got a log, or is that dirt? See how we're kind of going off there a little bit? That's why I kind of like, you know, um, using full squared tiles for this kind of stuff. Yeah, let's just keep it like this for now. Now I'm just going to go ahead and uh, press escape, by the way, to get out of that. And uh, I'm going to drag it on over here. Very bottom left corner. Press period. Zoom in. There we go. Yeah, there we go. That's perfect. All right. So yeah, there's the. This is how you do the tiles. Now, if you want the player to be able to collide with the tiles, we are going to right-click the player, go to Actor Control, and we're going to give him a Draw Actor effect by going to Events, Add, Draw Actor, Script Editor. So we are going to say Y velocity plus equals 0.5. So that's going to make him fall at the velocity of like a half a pixel per frame, but it's going to increase. So the more frames, as you can see there, the more frames you know that he's falling the fa he increases by 0.5 per frame that makes sense <laughs> you can play around with that uh, the higher means faster lower means slower uh, so now what we're gonna do is we are going to add a collision so collision we're gonna select top side of tiles repeat yes yeah uh, you can choose yes or no there then we're gonna say a physical response so you can zero means he stops completely um, one means that he completely inverts his direction so he'll bounce you can do 0.5 if you want to make him slowly bounce and etc we're gonna make him stick so we're gonna say zero for that now we're gonna go left or right side of tiles yes repeat now we are going to do in the script editor we're gonna go we're gonna we're gonna type double y v e l equals y velocity so we're capturing his y velocity and then we're going to go to the variable size functions. We're going to select uh, physical response, and we're also going to do zero again. But after that, we're also going to type y velocity equals y vel. So it's going to basically allow him to stop only left and right. So we're going to click uh, close on that. And as you can see, he now collides. And uh, we don't have any jump thing yet. As you see, he kind of hits the wall too. Right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to uh, make a little jump ability. So let's go ahead and add a key down event. Oops, not draw actor. Go ahead and add a key down event. I guess spacebar would be good. Everyone uses spacebar. We're going to select disable. And we're going to go to add action. And then script editor. Now we're going to go to variables and we're going to make a variable called jump. So we're going to type jump. And then we're going to press enter. So the variable jump, we're going to say if jump. Oops. Yeah, that's right. If jump equals equals zero, we're going to set jump to one, and we're going to say y velocity equals negative ten. Let's do twelve. So he's going to jump uh, pretty high. Go 
and click OK. We're going to uh, clear that out, or just close it out. Now we need to do one more thing before the jumping will work. Go to Add, Collision, Top Side of Tiles, repeat Yes. Then we're going to do Jump equals 1. Or, oops, Jump equals 0, sorry. <laughs> And uh, the next thing we're going to do is, where was I? I had to pause for a moment. I left off. Let me kind of rethink. Okay, so um, I think we should be done there. Let's go ahead and test that out. Space bar. And when you see when you land, you can jump again. But you'll also notice when you walk off, you can jump while falling. Uh, the way to fix that is you want to go to Draw Actor. And now we are going to do If y velocity is greater than or equal to 1.5 let's do a 2 yeah let's do two. then we're gonna say jump equals 1 so if you're falling you're not gonna be able to jump as you can see when you start off you're not able to jump now unless you start unless you press space like right as you uh, begin the game so yeah that's that's pretty much this episode uh, it's been a pretty short episode but that's pretty much it and that's how you that's how you uh, cover gravity and stuff so yay! So far, so good. So we walk against the wall here. Walk against that wall. And you can see when you uh, just get on the edge here. Oh, let's get on the edge. It will slide off slowly. All right. So uh, thank you guys very much for watching this episode, and I will see you all later. Don't forget to check out the what? I lost. Brain fart, man. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.